March 20th, March 12th, uh, 2019, Tuesday. This video is a bit difficult, but it's a lot of, uh, a lot of witch behavior, a lot of cartel behavior that I have to figure out how to communicate. When you have tactics like voice to skull, remote neural monitor, fray effects and sonic auditory effects being used, and the Medusa, the Medusa is such that in my phase two of my mind control uh, being used, what my, there was a hand, a black female handler that I had, and she would take these very x-ray imageries of my cardiac system, of my cardiac energy, and it was resonance energy, and they would call it the resonance energy of my cardiac system. And then they, she would also make signatures. She would make a lot of uh, resonance energy signatures on my cardiac system and my brain system. And she had the, uh, the spook tower was an annihilation tower. It was a black hoodlum tower. And they would say uh, when, they, when they placed the Medusa energy signatures on my cardiac system they would say they would say it in a spook tower voice and they would say medusa medusa yeah it's medusa so medusa was from the voodoo and the spook tower the effects of the frequencies in which they would say it is unfathomable unless you come across it yourself unless you're a target of it yourself Anyways, in my, uh, with the Medusa capability, the energy frequency, uh, the energy wires that the second Medusa made on my, on my cardiac system, my throat and my uh, ear canals. It runs from my ear canals down the throat to my cardiac system. My cardiac system is always regulated as to how much strength I have and how much memory I have. Uh, and in, in my auditories, the third Medusa is a black Medusa also. And she's always saying um, horrendous things. And this is my limited vocabulary saying it. Um, so what I, a, a lot of the things when there's so many uh, neural technology tactics being used on the cardiac system, on the nervous system, because there's a cardiac system, there's also the spinal cord. And the throat chakra, the chakras of the throat system, the vocal system, and the brain. With all of these, and they use all the chakras in the, uh, in the energy system of the target. With all of this, these tactics, they can make witch moods. They can behave out uh, witch moods in the target. They can also behave out witch modes in the target. The modes are encapsulated behavior, uh, whereas the moods are uncapsulated behavior. With the moods, the target can feel the heat of the, of the mood that is being exhibited on the target. Whereas in the mode, the, targets, uh, the target knows what kind of mode it is, but the target doesn't feel the heat of it. Um, and in the, there's also prisms. The prisms are like energy doorways for the entities or the witch, witches, reptilians, uh, Mayans, Hopis, uh, Akinas, Filipinas are the Agamis. The Agamis are like the Mayans, except they're from they're from Philippines. They're like the Hopis, except they're from Philippines. They're like a witch tower of Philippines. They're a Rosicrucian witch tower. From Philippines. Uh, so, uh, and then you have the wider shade ingrates. The wider shade ingrates, they are wider shade uh, witches. They're also like the Mayans, but they're ingrates. They have a rat type of behavior. They will write, uh, they will act out rat type of behavior and God's sake, I forgot the rest. They also do a horrendous amount of manipulations. And 
let's see the butch tower is such that you have the male the male bitch the male bitches or the bitches that are male and they are and they play out just like the um like the bitch tower and in the male butch tower you have the hard whites you have the black uh, spook tower and you have the Spanish Rosicrucians the South American Rosicrucians and and the Lucifer uh, except the Lucifer there's a lot of the female ingrates a lot of them are the female ingrates and then there are a horrendous amount of exclusive blonde females that appear to be both from the planetary realm and also from earth theater and they have uh, made uh, a witch tube in my vocals it's a radiation witch tube through which they will do their scripts and their rantologies and then the rosicrucians the rosicrucians and the south asian there's also south asian butch tower uh, from Philippines and China and his name is Hiss and he also has a radiation tube in my vocals in which he does hissing he will do a lot of he works from the beast realm the deacons and um, the Padres uh, Rosicrucians Catholic Rosicrucians and they they do a lot of their hissing in a radiation tube um, so I'm gonna I just made a list here it's um, the bitch tower the female bitch tower it, it, what both the female bitch tower and the male bitch uh, bitch tower will do a bitch heat mode the bitch heat mode is a sexual heat mode uh, it's also a despised heat mode uh, a bitch uh, a bitch heat mood and a despised heat mood is such that they they will target by despising uh, the targets uh, they will also have a sexual harlot mood a sexual harlot mood I mean I hope that would be explain itself I mean these are the female bitch tower uh, from from the Rosicrucianness and the indigenous indigenousness will have a sexual mood and it's the same thing with their male with their male hood they will become a sexual mood uh, there's the bitch flame mood in this in the bitch flame mood which means that they can have like a sexual harlotness which in itself is a it's a trashy sexual mood and then they also have like a bitch flame mood in which they can they can act out romantically they can behave out romantically or they can sense out romantically and uh in a soulmate way they can do those they have because they have these kind of moods a bitch itch mood is such that their a uh, bitch itch mood is such that a a bitch harlot will be itching for sexualness and for uh, violence uh, for crimes for shame uh, uh, pregnancies uh, traumas bestiality abuse the abuse is child abuse domestic abuse uh, wherever a bitch mood or a bitch itch can find a target that it can that can it can bullion a bitch glow is such that it is a pregnant glow there's a lot of it's a frequency that you have to figure out a lot of the a lot of the army bitches in the army bitches of the catholic army has a bitch glow uh, a bitch hive mood or mode is that they are when they target a, a target with all these moods and these itches 
and these heat and these flames. Their goal is to hive the target. A target being hived becomes a slave to them psychotronically. The, the bitch army will be interacting with the target wirelessly through the perception and through the cardiac and the nervous system control system. They will have control over the target's nervous system. I myself have experienced this and they have done this to my, uh, to my nephews, to my sisters, and to my mother. Uh, the bitch hive mode. Uh, bitch hive mood is of such, uh, when I go outside with my nephews, they'll have a lot of Filipinos, uh, a lot of Filipino bitch tower army or a Mayan bitch tower army or a black Kista bitch tower army or an Ingrid, uh, bitch tower army. They will be outside and they will interact psychotronically with my nephew to the point that my nephew feels very oppressed, traumatized. And he, you know, because of the bitch tower, they're trying to attract him psychotronically to them through a hive capability to force him to come to them. And they have that capability. The bitch snitch mode is such that because there's a, the bitch army is constantly surveilling the family members of the main, of the main target the bitch snitch mode will constantly narc so that the targets the, uh, the targets that are slave to them through the hive mode capability uh, that the targets will never feel uh, a sense of privacy and a sense of sovereignty and have to constantly be wary of the bitch army the bitch stalking mode is that the bitch a bitch army will stalk and the stalking mood and mode can be sensed i can sense it when a bitch uh when a bitch army is mooding into me as a stalker the bitch stalking the stalking is s t o c k i n g versus s t a l k i n g the stalking is such that when they stalk on the energy of the target when they vampire on the target when they stalk the target uh when they when they heat the target when they despise the target they uh, they take the assets of the the energy assets of the target the nervous system assets of the target the cardiac system uh assets of the target a target's memories are assets a target's learned knowledge is our assets. The resonance and frequencies of the organic energy of the target is assets. The economy of a target is also assets. Uh, let's see. So they call it stalking by taking the target's energy assets. And the cosmic uh, energy and the cosmic, the cosmic existence of the targeted person is also being stalked. And it's cut, done through the psychic energy because the bitch tower and its hive capability on the target, the bitch army douses on the memories and the neural, the neural pathways of the target so uh, so what well, so it's stalking because it's stalking the it's also uh, s t o c k i n g of the cosmic energy of the target the cosmic energy pours down to earth as an as a fine as economy as success in careers success in academics uh, joy and happiness in a target's life. These are all stalked by the stalker, which is the bitch tower army. The bitch plot cooking mood. The bitch plot cooking mood is that the bitch army will bitch mood into the target as the target is cooking in the kitchen. And the bitch army 
the bitch stalker will start thinking out plots, whatever is within the day and whatever thoughts are coming about. These bitch army knows how to, um, how to, they want me to say to how to integrate it, but this bitch army knows how to plot it into a plot. Uh, against the targeted family members, uh, the target itself, the target's friends, the target's familiarities, the target's acquaintances. Uh, 